gentlemen, welcome back to another episode. This is Miles Z, Miles TV. Another day, another adventure, another airport, another string line of payphones. <laughs> is this hotel pager friendly? I'm not getting a sig on my beeper. Is there a payphone bank? Bunch of payphones. Alrighty guys, yeah, we had a dope Christmas. Your boy got a coat and we're in Chicago, so it's like, you know, six degrees right now. I already now drive from Providence to Chicago, so now I have to go from Chicago to Vegas because I have work tomorrow at like 11 a.m. But the flight is completely full and there's like 10 people on standby. So flight leaves in about an hour, so I'm gonna head over to the gate. Hopefully I get a seat on this flight, give me some good vibes, I know you guys will. But since being a flight attendant, we have this thing called the jump seat. So there's an extra seat if the flight's completely full that we can sit on. Uh, but there's like 10 employees listed, so pretty much everyone can just have at it. Uh, first come, first serve, so I gotta jet over there right now. If you guys are part of the family, make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash the like on this video, and let's have a day, baby. Hey, how's it going? So I if you got a fourth to Vegas by any chance? Baby, all right, guys. So I got a seat. Well, not an actual seat. I got the jump seat, which is pretty much where the flight attendants sit. Uh, so that means I might be sitting on the jump seat for about four hours. But we'll find out as soon as we all get boarded up, and uh, to figure out if I actually have to sit on that, you know, riggedy old thing uh, for the entire four hours, or if you know your boy gets an open seat. But 99.99% getting to Vegas tonight, which is dope. That's what I'm talking about, baby. The only reason that I might not is in case it's uh, overweight. So it has happened one time where there were open seats on the flight, couldn't get on just because it was overweight. So we'll see, but your boy needs to get some grub. And you know I've been eating you know, burgers, and fries, and chicken fingers and stuff. So let's get something different. Okay, uh, yeah, it was a salad and I swear I would never lie to you guys. Uh, all right, nah, it was a burger, real talk. But like, it's all good, you know, salads, burgers, what are you talking about? It's the same exact thing. All right, guys, so a couple things I wanna talk about right now. Um, so as you guys know, I might be sitting in the jump seat, not sure, when they say the words fourth on fourth, that means, yo, gotta sit in the jump seat for the next, you know, four some odd hours. Uh, so that's not what we want to hear, but it's all good if we do. Either way, we're getting home to Vegas. Number two, guys, I know that you guys know that I have absolutely nowhere to live right now. So I was living in Rhodey, but I told Nolives today, I'm like, bro, I am out. I'm out. I'm either going to Vegas, California, I don't know. I'm looking at a couple of places in Vegas uh, tomorrow before work, so I'll show you guys that a little bit. And uh, yeah, so I'm pretty much homeless at the moment, but uh, yeah, nice we'll uh, figure out that bridge when we come to it. Hey. That's about it. You guys can sweat with me, obviously, and uh, whew, wish me luck. Give me good vibes. You guys give me good vibes. You always do it. Pound it, baby. Nah, for real. Do it. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Woody, fourth on fourth in cockpit and cockpit, please. And I lost, <laughs> but it's all good. Still get the ride back to Vegas, so no big deal. Uh, yeah, I'll be sitting uh, right here for the next uh, four hours and 20 minutes. So it's a little gamble. That's what happens sometimes. And speaking of gamble, we made it to Vegas, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, feels good to be back in Vegas. Yo, Alex, who said that? <laughs> yeah, I never thought I'd even say that. Yeah, but. <laughs> I don't know, I just feel good to be back on the West Coast, Vegas. I gotta do a couple things, obviously, you know, I gotta call the hotel. Cause you know, every time I come to Vegas, like I told you before, earlier in the vlog, I'm still uh, still pretty much homeless, so I gotta get a hotel tonight. Uh, so I'm gonna call the hotel, hopefully they have rooms available. See, that's, that's one of the things in Vegas. If you try to get a room in Vegas, it's like there's something going on every single day, you know, EDC's in town, you got New Year's Eve sometimes. Yeah, New Year's Eve. Sometimes. Well, no, that, that that's once a year, but um, <laughs> you guys know what I'm saying. So I'm actually gonna park it right here, give them a call. Hopefully they have rooms tonight, and then they'll send the shuttle. And uh, yeah, ah, guys, actually on this flight, I was uh, talking to the guy I was sitting next to on the jump seat, flight attendant, and uh, 
I got an idea for something crazy. You guys gotta help me out with it though. Help me make a decision, you know? Actually, I'm gonna do it either way, but I would like, you know, your input on some tips, do's and don'ts, but I'll get to that in a little bit. Kylie, long time no talk, how are you? I'm doing great. Um, do you guys have rooms tonight? Oh, I would love one. I'll take seven. All right, no, I don't need seven. One's good, one's good. All right, thank you so much. Yo, that's my girl, that's my girl Kylie. You would think that Kylie Jenner doesn't work at a hotel in Vegas, but she does. She does. And uh, yeah, we're actually, you know, pretty good friends now since I stay there. I've been staying there this entire month. We'll have you guys meet her in a second, actually. How about that? So, uh, say what up to Callie. Alright, so Callie was not there, but it's all good because you guys know when, like, I don't know, you just go somewhere and they just, like, they know you. They know your name and everything. It's dope. They know how you like everything. Let's check it out. Wait, what? I've never seen something so beautiful. That's more like it. Shout out, baby. <laughs> also, guys, shout out to the hotel. I got this little, uh, boom, bottle of water, and we got dinner, baby. Animal crackers. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Like, this is probably dinner. <laughs> Malos, why are you saying probably? You know, it's actually dinner. All right, bro, shut up. All right, Malos. Okay, Gladstone, cut it out. Cut it out. <laughs> Alrighty guys, as you know, if you follow me already on Snapchat and Instagram, I came up with this idea when I was sitting on the jump seat with the other flight attendant. I'm like, bro, have you ever gone to Times Square on New Year's Eve? And he's like, uh, yeah, I have actually. And I'm like, dude, tell me everything. Tell me everything. Because I think that might be the move this year. Um, I'm working a three-day trip tomorrow. So that's the, uh, the 28th, 29th, 30th. So I'd be getting back on the 30th, but it gets back at like 11. So it'd be tough. I might try and catch a red eye to New York uh, for New Year's Eve. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm doing for New Year's Eve. I am off for New Year's Eve and then like, I don't know, like five days after that. So I don't know what I'm doing. I've always wanted to do it, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, yo, might as well do it. Uh, so I'm like, you know, 80% down to do it. So we'll see what happens. Uh, but guys, if you've done it before, let me know in the comments, please. Like, do, what should I not do? Like, what should I bring? Um, just pretty much like the do's and don'ts. I need to know the do's and don'ts if you guys have done it before. Uh, or are you down? Like, are any of my friends out there down? Who's down there? Who's gonna be there? Um, yeah, all these questions. If you guys don't mind answering, I have no idea what I'm getting myself into if I'm doing it, so. We will see, we will see what happens. Um, guys, the 31st, uh, New Year's Eve, I'm gonna put out my year in review video. This is gonna be like the sickest video highlighting every single thing I've done this year, guys. This year has been lit. As soon as that comes out, smash a like on it. Smash a like on it with your nose right before you even watch it. Yeah, so guys, that's gonna take me a long time to edit and stuff. I don't know, I might take a day off, not sure. Actually, you know what, no, I have like a bunch of stuff that like, Guys, from like old mystery flights that like I haven't even uploaded yet. 2017 was lit. 2018 is gonna be even more lit. Litter. I ain't talking about litter, but litter. Like, mass lit. Oh yeah, and so since I get back at like 11, I don't know if I'll be able to catch a red eye. So I might switch this trip to another trip. Uh, I'm supposed to be in Detroit tomorrow and then Fort Lauderdale the night after that. I don't know, maybe I'll switch it up tomorrow. Also, I'm gonna be looking at apartments tomorrow. Maybe I'll get in a place in Vegas, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I'm just a vlogger out here just trying to live my life. And uh, yo, Malus, you looking good, bro. <laughs> Psych. <laughs> if you guys aren't part of the family, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Smash the like on this video. And you guys know what to do. This is Malus TV. Smash that like button and let's fly. Baby. <laughs>